Okay, uh, last night I was working on some After Effects and um, I created this video um, with the word mouse flip and here's what it looks like. So mouse comes in, flip, flips the mouse, it zooms in to discovery through media. And that's kind of like what mouse flip is all about, is discovery through media. So let's see how we can do that because you, as an application you could use this as for your story title of a story or something similar to that. So I have a new uh, project in a new composition. I'm going to call this um, title. If you're working on your story project, this would be part of your um, story composition, not a new project. And first I need a uh, background, so Command Y. And for my background, um, I'm going to choose like a light gray. And hit OK. And then next I need a text, so I'm going to get control click on one of the layers, new text. And for the text, I'm going to put in mouse. And then for my font, I'm going to use hmm, what should I use? I'll just use courier. Traveling type wire. And I'm going to adjust some of the fonts so it's a little bit closer together. Uh, you can use the font that you you would like. Okay. And I'm going to make that a little bit smaller so it has room to flip. Okay. And now I'm going to, and I'll change the color as well. Okay, so I'm going to start it off. So I'm going to start my mouse on the side. I'm going to come to maybe a second. Okay, I'm going to click and drag it over and hold the shift key so it's straight. I'm going to bring it right about there. Okay, and next I need uh, the flip. I'm just going to copy the mouse layer, Command C, Command V, and I'm going to call this flip and I'm going to take this grab it move it out go back to zero my timeline and for my mouse I needed to move that as well so uh, to make something move I'm going to transform and its position so I'm going to hit the stopwatch for position move my mouse Right about here. But don't forget to move your uh, timeline out so you can hit a keyframe right about there. Okay, there we go. Now I'm going to go to my flip and hit the letter P on the keyboard for positions. Start my stopwatch. And I'm going to go back to where mouse stopped because then I want flip to come in right here and right about there. So mouse is going to come in. And I'm going to move this keyframe out. So there we go, mouse. So right when it touches, I'm going to rotate them. Okay, so uh, to rotate, <clears throat> it's R. So I'm going to hit the stopwatch, and then I'm going to uh, scrub it and rotate it all the way vertical. But don't forget to move your timeline out, maybe a second. there and I'm going to do the same thing to mouse. So hit the rotation, move it out.
pass out to you. There. So this is what we look at so far. Mouse, clip, flips them over, and here we go. So next I'm going to use this letter D for discovery. Um, so what I'm going to do is go to the flip and I'm going to go to scale S and I'm going to um, bring scale out like really big. Okay. But before I do that, I need to have my stopwatch. And then I'm going to move it out maybe a second. Okay. So uh, scrub the scale really big. I'm also going to go hold down the shift key and hit uh, P for position so I can see both. And for my position, I'm going to bring this up like this right about there. So I go mouse flip. Boom. And then it kind of zooms in here. Like that. Now I'm going to add the words discovery for because I'm going to use this D for discovery. So I'm going to hit the command click on one of the, one of the layers. And hit new text. And I'll type in discovery. I'm going to change the font color uh, maybe to a reddish. And I'm going to move that. On top, because I'm going to start it on top. So for discovery, for P is position. I'm going to start the stopwatch, move it out a second, and it's going to come right in to here. I like that. And I'm also going to go into hold on shift key and uh, scale S, shift S. hit the stopwatch, move it out a second, and for the scale I'm going to zoom that in as well, because it's going to go straight in. There we go. So this is what I got so far. It's coming in here. It's going to come in like this. Now, when it comes in, I want the mouse flip to dissolve because I don't need that anymore. So I'm going to go into mouse and uh, opacity. It's right here, opacity, and I'm going to hit the stopwatch because right now it's at 100. I'm going to bring it out and then make that zero. And I'm going to copy these keyframes, command C, and just select them by drawing a box over them. Go up to flip and paste those keyframes in flip. Alright, and now the final part is to write through media.